Hello, welcome glorious peoples of the interweb. Thank you for tuning in to Crowman17. I am Crowman. Welcome back. Thank you again. Oh my god. I'm happy. Cut that out. So, first of all, yes, it is true I did not attend the the pro-choice march. I have two excuses for that. One uh, honest excuse and one bullshit excuse. You know, my bullshit excuse is that, as some of you know, I, uh, when I was younger, I had a couple of abortions, and I don't really feel like I'm qualified to attend that rally, even though they're not exactly checking people on whether or not they are qualified to go. Uh, I do feel kind of bad because it was such a big turnout, and I wanted to go, and I even marked that I was going, but the truth is that I didn't get a reminder that I was going to go, and I ended up having some friends over on Friday night. We drank and woke up about an hour before the march started, pretty hungover, and half hour before uh, it started, I saw my notification, and it was just like, yeah, I, God... I, in my condition, I, I don't think I can just jump in the shower and suit up and drive up to San Francisco. And But I was very happy to hear that it was a, such a huge turnout and that uh, Donald Trump acknowledged it. Uh, it made me feel even more bad about not going. Uh, also, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing pot and politics anymore. Might be done with that, but I'll still have segments where I have guests come on, Mr. Gold, We'll talk about things, we'll overdo our footage that we do from events, and um, you know, that'll still keep going. Might even still call it pot and politics, but I, I don't know. I think I might, might quit pot. <laughs> Anyways, so what we're about to do today is we're going to go to San Francisco and we're going to do what some of you might call enabling. We're gonna go and we're gonna clean up San Francisco. And I'm gonna meet up with some friends. I'm gonna meet up with some other Republicans. This is a Republican event. Uh, and I know that you know, like not everybody's gonna be agreeing with, with this, but I, I am very curious about what we're gonna find and I wanna keep tallies of <clears throat> how many straws we find versus how many syringes we find. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna see we're gonna see just how big this straw problem really is. At least, in, this is how I'm I'm gonna do this, since they seem to be making such a huge big deal about the straws. But uh, you know, San Francisco is a very well. It's pretty much one of the most toxic cities in America. You know, people kind of think that oh well, if it's a polluted, then it sh the air should be filled with smoke and blah blah blah. And, and San Francisco's not like that. Well, no. Well, everything from the waist down though is is horribly disgusting. You know, we we had the uh, hepatitis outbreak a few years back, and I'm sure that's still going on. It, really, this is just one of the worst places that you could ever be walking around barefoot. Uh, you know, the, the 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 bacteria and the disease and the, the sheer amount of trash around San Francisco is so, so bad. And it was it was bad when I was a kid too, but I've really watched it get worse. I've really watched it get bad over the years. I remember when I was a kid, my dad drove up an alley one time and and uh, he slowed down really quick and he said to me, you, you gotta be careful when you're driving up some of these alleys. What looks like a pile of trash could actually be a person. And yeah, that, that's true, you never really know what, uh, what San Francisco is. Um, what they're hiding under all that all that garbage, and I'd, I'd like I I like this idea that I heard. I don't know if it's going anywhere or if it went anywhere about where Donald Trump was actually going to hit the city of San Francisco with vi environmental uh, violations, which he absolutely should. I don't understand why if you know if this city is you know so liberal, so Democrat run, and they're so concerned about the environment, why is their environment in such a crappy, crappy place? Why does it stink so bad? Why is there so many piles of poop? Why are there so many filthy people everywhere? Why do people just drop their trash on the ground? Why is it that bad if they really, really care? Now, that's going to be some of the questions we're going to be answering when we go out there today. So, without further ado, I hope you all enjoy this video and uh, we're going to see what we find out. Let's go.
Well, we made it. Oh, we got an Antifa member. Right there. <laughs> Masked goon in black. Perfect timing. Black gloves scoping everybody out. Oh, we might want to get a little prepared for him. Come here. Do you see? Do you see? Um, right directly behind you. Can I go behind you? Can I go behind you? Oh, I, I, I saw some fancy. Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, my Now he's just afraid of the coronavirus. <laughs> uh huh. <laughs> they're, they're outsider. A little troublemaker. Let's see what's going on here. Action already. What's going on? Thank you, Stalin! Thank you, Stalin! I knew it, I knew it, I knew it! I knew he was doing something, I knew he was up to something. Oh, oh, officer of the kitty park, we put him in charge. Boss of the mob right here. Y'all have to leave by the children's park. We don't need to leave by the children's park like right now. We don't need to leave. Hey, Stalin! Hey, Stalin! Move on! They're calling the police. Good. Good. You don't want you to leave. You don't want you to leave. Say something a little more convincing. I don't think that's going to happen. I'm glad I got here just in time. This is all they got. This is quickly turned in from a clean up to a dirt down. You don't know what you're talking about. If you don't have a permit, you cannot be right trying to convert you. I'm trying to convert you. I'm trying to beat your face. Y'all like y'all have a lot of Democrats. I don't have to fuck the Democrats. Fuck the Democrats, bro. Fuck the Democrats, bro. Hey, listen, fuck the Democrats, bro. 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 Hey, do y'all have a permit to be out here though? You don't need a permit! Move on! You don't need a permit! 
He ran up to me. My dad's in the military. I don't have to, you don't have to give me the balls and attorney. I don't, I don't need balls. Oh, so your dad's in the military. You sure so if so, so somebody shoots you, your dad, your dad shoots back. That's a good thing. And my parents are in So I don't need to. <laughs> We're citizens. We don't need attorneys. Okay. We can talk. Let's go clean. Hey, let's go clean. Let's go clean. Let's go clean. Okay. Let's go clean. 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 Let's go clean
anything I need to know. Effort. I just didn't want you to uh, be isolated and be called racist all the time. No, no, no. You know what? I don't mind taking the heat. Oh, no, no, no. When they Thank call you. me racist, I know exactly what to say because my question is do, do they even know? They say Black Lives Matter. How many black people are living on Skid Row? How many black people are living on the streets here in San Francisco? We, Meanwhile, we, all these white people won't actually go out there and help the black community. So no, they are solas racistas. Thank you so much for what you do. Nice to meet you. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. <laughs> yeah, you ain't no Ben Burke, I I missed you all the way over here. You gotta, you gotta tell him. That's Scott. That's Scott. Oh. 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 What's your name? Nice to meet you. My pleasure. Scott, right? Yeah. Nice to meet you. First name? Nice to meet you, Steven. And who are you with today? I'm with myself, and I got my Excellent. friend here, Louisa. Oh, and well, I'm we're just anyone here. who is a friend of this young lady is a personal dear friend of mine. Thank, <laughs> Thank you for coming out. Absolutely. Glad I'm here. Action as soon as we showed up. Yeah, I know, right? And look. Well, don't let me interrupt. Yeah, we did. Well, no, 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 no. That's a lot of trash. Yeah. Here, wait. I'm going to take a picture of the trash we cleaned up and that they picked yeah, yeah. up no trash. Imagine that might be 1% of what's here. Hate. Yeah. Love yes. is hate. Hey. I mean, it's so yeah. clear. It's so clear. Oh, they don't even understand that this is going on all over social media. They don't even understand that we got so many great videos of yeah. us showing love and them being hateful. And actually, they punched, they punched, they punched, they punched Lady Maga. Yeah. Yeah. A hate crime against a gay person. Right. These people did a hate crime against a gay person. Right. Yes. Yet they're so loving yes. and tolerant yes. and peaceful. Right. No, you know that's what these people are. Yes. They are none of that. They are the antithesis. Yeah. And we got it all on the video. Sorry, sir. Can you say that one more time? It's just so funny. Drops for Latinos. Oh, what? Just that one more time. It's just so funny. Oh, what? Just that one more time. That's a fake laugh I've ever saw on whatever. Just say no, 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 that's right. Twenty-five percent. That's right. We're gonna get 40, 45 this time. Today or yesterday? Yes, that Fuck you! Don't ever say that shit to me ever again. Fuck you! Yes, oh. 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 Why is that But you just said you should never said anything to me then. So now you're never going to you? I wasn't talking to you. I'm not talking to Protest against the. Hey, everybody, this 
Scott Fessler. So this gay American right here was punched violently by a member of Antifa. So what, what exactly happened in San Francisco? I know I'm getting it on video. I want people to know that this gay American was hate crimed by this violent person over here. And I think it's wrong. What exactly happened? Yeah. That person followed you the entire time we were picking up trash. And one of them was sitting over here. He ran by me, grabbed my hat, and when I grabbed my hat back, he was still being in the stomach. Oh, yeah. It's full of it. It's where he parked it. See, he's leaving. That's the person. Because he knows he's guilty. Running from the crime. Are you got Got him. You okay? Run away. Run away from the bed. So what is your minority status as a problem? She's not doing anything. What is she doing? She's standing here. And what was that? Why is it happening now? That was an hour ago. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Yeah.